Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today we'll be doing the last box from our case, the Lost Ex um, Caverns of Excellent Collector Booster Box. So this is box number six um, of the case that I normally open just to let people see what the drop rate is like. Gives you a good idea. It was opening just one box and things like that. Don't really give us a really good example. All right, so. Well, one case isn't that much as well, but it's one box. Anyway, so each pack, um, this time you get a foil treasure trove box topper, which is only foil, and then at the set boosters you're getting non foil, and then you get 12 foil, oh, well, 12 collected booster packs of um, Lost Caverns of Excellence. So far, it actually hasn't been that bad. Um, it actually does show that the special gears cards is actually quite hard to pull. Um, it's not going to be like, ooh, Wilds of Eldraine, you, you get a doubling season, you, I get a doubling season, everybody gets a doubling season. Um, this time it's actually pretty difficult, and I personally think that's not too bad. It's better for like long term, because what you don't want is you don't want the short term, a bunch of like loose, com like just people just losing faith in the card game. Alright, so the first mythic we heard is the vampire demon blood litter that's pretty awesome um oh oh look at that that's a loss of foiling oh i mean it's uh, it's showing the foiling on the bottom it's a loss of the paint so i didn't do that <laughs> i thought it was just wow that's pretty sad so anyway so quality control so our first mythic we got a damaged blood litter foil blood litter showcase blood litter <laughs> Oh, the great door. So that's all. Rare brass. Oh, the cards are so. And we got uh, Palani's Hatcher. The cards are very. I don't know, it's, it's just really hard to navigate through the cards. My guess is because they're all from different print um, runs. So that's why. I heard a lot of people talk about like, inconsistency, but looking at it, you are correct because everything is actually done on a different print run, uh, print sheet. So they they obviously gather, they print them in different. Um, ooh, nice glimpse of the core. Um, they 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 print them all separately and then they consolidate them all together. So that's why you'll never really have a very smooth feel of oh the cards actually all feel the same. They all actually do feel quite different. Um, it is a bit of a hit there and a, a miss as well. Sunken Citadel. So that's our foil extended foil. So that said, that's why sometimes it's quite hard to navigate through the cards. Lodestone. Foil Mountain. Light Beetle, so um, showcase, um, showcase non foil. We got blue, a foil blue, so that's pretty awesome. Wow, we got Mary with a light duelist. So, this one is our special guest foil mythic again. Oh, pretty lucky. I think the last three boxes, our, our, six, um, our special guest cards have some old mythics. That's not too bad. I remember. The Millennium Calendar, so um, Mythic. Echoing Dip. I think it's going to be quite weak for the rest of the box. <laughs> the rest of the box. <coughs> Sorry about that. Common, uncommon, uncommon. Island. 
Threshing. Awakening. Nice spawn hole Dracosaur. What is this? Non foil. We got a foil island from um, Jurassic Park. And lastly, we got Brass Tunnel Grinder. So I think we're halfway down. Are we halfway? Yeah, we're halfway. Shaker. Where is this? We got Savage Order and we got Dive Frail. Mm, that one was a bit underwhelming. Death Cap. <laughs> that was screaming. Got blood letter again. So this is not this time is a non foil. We got command tower and we got bedrock tortoise. Tortoise. Lucky last four packs. Yeah, you can definitely see that like um, the cards were packaged all different that's why you, you get like sometimes you get like dust parts on different layers of the cards um i mean like oh we got the, the blue god mythic and then we got another command tower followed by deep boot so what i mean is like um they are they're on like different stacks of the cards and things like that so you can really tell London. Swamp. <laughs> Ooh. So, Foil Millennium Calendar. That's a cute card. I, I quite like that card. Um, not the best, but I think it's pretty cool. We got Indoraptor. Alright, lucky last two. I think. Pretty much that's it. One, two, three, four. So, don't move. Lucky last. Bringer of the last gift. <laughs> it's so colorful. Alright, lucky last pack. The gift house special guest. And I think. Admiral Brass, Alton, oh, and we got Killen, basically the new planeswalker. All right, and so this one obviously was a bit more weaker for um, the end um, as a weaker box. All right, anyway, let's have a look, shall we? Is it Arcane? That's Arcane Signet, right? So I think we got a foil Arcane Signet. I didn't damage it, did I? Okay. Foil Arcane Signet. So that is our treasure. Alright, so let's have a look. Um, 
not one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So around seven. Um, only eight mythics this time. So it's actually a lot more different than our previous one. We did actually get another mythic for our um, special guest, which is actually not too bad. Um, like if it is one in the box, I think this is not a bad hit. <laughs> I've seen worse. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I think that's it for excellent. Next time I see you guys will definitely probably be Ravnica Remastered. So we'll be opening um, a case of the Collector Boosters on that one. And afterwards we're going to um, murder. Thanks for watching again guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Excellent. And take it easy.